is because they've got to deploy the money, right? And so they're not all going to be the best and they're not all going to get the best attention and they're not all going to get the best management team. What you have in this situation is one, there's a far lower barrier to entry because the, the checks that you need to write as an investor to get into it aren't a million plus. They're far lower often. And two, you've got someone who one is a very highly capable individual with usually a very good academic background and good business experience. And this is their everything. They're putting their whole time and all of their energy into making sure that this works because this is their career. This is one single investment for you, but for them, it's everything. And what could be better when you're an investor passively just watching someone really go for it? And 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 so the reality here is that for investors, but also for operators, it, it, it just makes sense. It also provides a brilliant succession solution for business owners, um, knowing that someone's going to come in and nurture and develop and run the business that you've built over many years, usually. Um, and someone is there that cares and is going to give it that attention. I love that. And that what you're talking about and, and folks, what Carl and I are talking about is essentially the crux of the show. 